Hi everyone! In this lecture we will learn 5 ways how you can respond to apologies. Ничего страшного means nothing serious. It comes from combining страшный, which means scary, and ничего, which means nothing. So together it's something like nothing scary, but it really means nothing serious. So ничего страшного means like there is nothing to worry about. And if it's nothing serious, you say ничего страшного. Ни че во стра шна ва. Ничего страшного. Стра шны. Страшный. Все в порядке. It's okay. Порядок literally translates as order, so we can also understand it as everything is in order, everything is going well. Hence, все в порядке means that everything is fine. Basically, it has the same meaning as ничего страшного. So, no matter what you did, you're forgiven. Все в порядке. Все в порядке. Па ря дак. Порядок. Извинения приняты. Apologies accepted. This phrase is very cold. Imagine that someone does something to you and you are still angry and then you respond like, okay, apologies accepted. It's like you're making them a favor accepting their apologies, but with your facial expression you show that apology wasn't really accepted. And then you say, извинения приняты. И зви не ни я при ня ты. Извинения приняты. Let's take a look at example. A younger sister steals the top from her older sister, knowing the fact that she hates landing clothes, and when the older sister finds out about all this, a younger sister starts apologizing, and what she gets in response is apologies accepted, despite the fact that both of them know that the older sister is still angry. Нет, это вы простите. No, you forgive me. When you don't know whose fault it is, because it's not that obvious, you apologize to one another, saying, Нет, это вы простите. Нет, это вы простите. Нет, это вы простите. For example, you bumped into someone while running and the first thing you would say, извините. And that person who would think it was their fault would reply, нет, это вы меня простите. So it's kind of polite exchange of apologies. Бывает. It happens. Бывает is very informal. In such cases, it means it's nothing serious. It's nothing you should worry about. So you just say, бывает. It happens. Бывает. Бывает. For example, if you break a plate in the kitchen and your mom would say, Бывает, because there are a lot of other plates in the kitchen and this one was just taking space, except if it's a special one. Here we are. Now we know how to respond to apologies. Well done. See you in the next lecture, which is going to be about numbers. Пока-пока.